Hey guys, I'm going to do a how to care for your doll's hair or how to brush your doll's hair properly. So I've seen a lot of dolls with like really frizzy hair and I've watched YouTube videos on people opening their dolls or something and then they brush their hair and it's just something I don't like to watch if you treat your doll's hair like that. So, I'm going to show you how to um, manage their hair because I've seen a lot of people that don't look like they know how, so I'm going to show you. And this is also kind of like a how to brush your doll's hair too. So, if you're playing with your dolls and then her hair comes out looking like this, all messy like this. I had a lot of fun messing it up for this video so what you're gonna do is you're gonna need your brush and or pick and you're gonna start at the bottom. Let me like move this so I can like move her over here. Camera probs. Okay there we go. You're gonna start at the bottom Gently brush out the ends. I don't care if this takes five minutes, it's worth it. Because if you start up here at the top and pull all the way down really hard, you pull through her, their hair, it's going to create these hairs that aren't straight. And that's what causes your doll's hair to be frizzy. So just be sure you're starting to brush it from the bottom and working your way up gently. Oh, here's one of those hairs. I'll show you what they look like. I found one on her. She came with these, so I still haven't found all of them yet. So I'll show you what they look like. Okay. So here's what it looks like. If your doll's hair is filled with these things, it, their hair isn't going to be as soft. And this is the result of pulling through the snarls. Is this curly hair that you don't want. So just brush it the way I'm brushing it and it should turn out alright. And it should stay nice and soft and smooth. I get questions all the time how I keep the hair so shiny. I just tell them I brush it gently. Because if you don't know how to brush your doll's hair properly, no offense, well I guess I shouldn't say that. Like you shouldn't even have a doll. You should look up hair care first and then care for her hair. But, yeah. And then you will eventually just work your way up to the top like this and all the way down to the bottom with no snarls. I'm not done yet, so I'll show you curly hair or I'll tell you about curly hair because. Allie's is actually getting done right now. I have to take hers out soon, probably. So just brush it gently. Don't pull through the snarls. It's like I showed you these nasty little curly hairs. You're going to make your doll's hair frizzy and not appealing. And what you can do for curly haired dolls if their hair is snarly. Just take your spray bottle. Yes, mine is almost empty. I have to refill it. So let's just pretend Julie's hair is curly. Even though it's pin straight. I'm just going to give it a little spray. This water makes everything easier to comb out. I'm just going to comb it. Gently. Even though Julie's hair is already brushed out, it's easier. And there you go. 
and she still sheds like there's no tomorrow. I've already found a kind of a little small bald spot on her head, which makes me kind of sad because she's like over six months old and she already has a small bald spot on her head. Sad stuff. So, so that's how you do curly hair, that's how I do it. I would show you on Allie, but she has her hair up right now. So, obviously can't do her. And Kanani's hair is still in good condition, so I don't want to ruin it. So yeah, that's how you take care of your doll's hair. That's how I take care of it. Just be sure to start at the bottom and work your way up to the top. And if your doll has, you could do this for straight or curly, but it just makes it easier to brush for curly hair. I just give it a little spritz like that and then go ahead and brush the curly hair out. You can do it with straight hair as well, like I did with Julie. And... That's why I keep their hair shiny. I mean, it's really not that hard. Oh wow, Selena just celebrated her third year. She's three years old now. That was August 27th. Yeah, 27th. She turned three, and this is what her hair looks like. Needs a little bit of fixing, but it's still pretty shiny. All the way up to the top, ignore my awesome mess over there. Still fairly shiny. So, yeah. She is three years over, just a little over three years old now. And her hair is still in good condition. So, people always tell me my dolls look brand new. And then I tell them how old they are. And they freak out because of their age and then their shiny hair along with it. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just wanted to show you this because I get questions all the time. And, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.